What up, Shio? HG Lord Judge A, Rabbi T. Messiah. I want to talk to you about something very important here. You probably don't know this, but this is the most common blasphemous heresy uh, attempted, even by Christians, particularly Christians, as a matter of fact, or people who, who prescribe to the name of Christianity but are not really Christians. Okay, this is the most common thing, and it's disgusting, and I'll tell you what it leads to. Okay, so basically, I was hanging out, with, I was with somebody one time, and then someone came and visited us, and one of the people who came to visit us said to the person who I was with, when you're reading the scripture, here, read this part of scripture, when you're reading this, instead of saying, oh, Daniel, say, oh, your name, and I was like, whoa, what the, no, 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 I was like, hold on, you can't do that. You're not allowed to say your own name instead of the prophet's name you're reading on the page. That's the heresy. Heresy is when you you do teach or suppose contrary to the scripture. So if you're reading your name instead of the prophet's on the page, so God said to Daniel and you say God said to, then you're changing the scripture. That's not at all what is written. God did not say to you nor are you God you don't say your name instead of God or the Lord either you understand how heretical and blasphemous that is because this is what happens there's a lot of people who do it in fact there's an entire an entire culture who does it and they read the scripture and they say their name instead of the prophets on the page then they've they've programmed their brains to believe as if they've accomplished these works of the prophets. As if their ancestors, it's in their blood. That's blasphemy. That's heresy. No, you did not. First of all. Then after that, they want people to look at them. They expect people to look at them as if that's what they are. No, no, no. You don't know what I know, they say. You don't know me. You don't know who I am. Well, you're not all the prophets in the Bible. That's for sure. Nor are you the Lord. Nor are you God. So that's the first thing. But then you know what comes out of this? Then they take this as authority or right or ability, practice, to look at other people who have done things in their life and call themselves by their names. This is why it says in the scripture from Jesus' own mouth, In the last days many will come in my name, saying, I am he, and shall deceive many. Behold, I've told you beforehand. So that's the blasphemy. That's the heresy. You do not say your own name instead of the prophets on the page. Okay? God did not say that to you. So people have ideas. As a matter of fact, see, God blessed me like Joseph. So these people, they try to turn my blessing and call it the Joseph anointing. They said I had the Joseph anointing. Then they started trying to hand out the Joseph anointing, preaching the Joseph anointing. So no, there's there's no Joseph anointing that you pull out of the Bible. You understand? You're not. It's not a spell book. You're reading about a historical event. God does not respect those who change His word, and that's a big heresy. Changing God's word, trying to imagine yourselves as the important ones. That God was speaking to. So people look at you. You want people to look at you like Daniel? Are you a joke? You know what I mean? You do not mix with other people's spirits. Because people who are willing to do so are always willing to mix with a spirit more pure than their own. That's heresy. That's blasphemy. That's abomination. And that's what's been destroying the church. So, HMC Lord Jose, Rabbi T. Messiah, Wadao, Shayo, one man go need see, one man go, you need see, you need seed, and you ain't going to get it by saying your own name instead of the prophets on the page. Let everyone know that they who do so are condemned. You're condemned already. You're violating the second, the first, the first, second, and the third commandment. You're a three breaker. You know what that means? That means you're changing your idea of who God is. God is not a God who spoke to you. It's not God speaking to you. First of all, you're creating your own image of what God is. 
Well, that means you're not loving God. So there's one and two. But then three, you're taking the name of God in vain. You're calling it yourself. Calling yourself God? That's vanity. In vain. I bet you think this song is about you. You're so vain. No, bro. You don't grab onto other people. Zai Jai, Wadao.